Yo, what's up YouTube? This is Jamarit coming to you today with a brand new video, boys. And today, we are going through and spending all of our Team of the Season vouchers. So let's get right into the video. So guys, welcome to another video on the channel. And today, guys, we are finally going through and spending our Team of the Season vouchers. We waited until Ultimate Tots did come out, and obviously guys, you know, the SBCs, they have been changed since, um, and it has resulted in a bit of sort of just ruffle in the community. Um, it is, it is once again guys, you know, as expected, nothing will probably be done. Um, but what I'm going to be doing is going through and showing you uh, the conversion of around 900 vouchers guys, so I can get enough of the uh, La Liga points because we are going to be going for none other than 95 overall Cristiano Ronaldo. He costs 987 vouchers in total. Obviously this was not possible um, without the 200 voucher compensation. So without that guys, I don't think I would have been able to do this. So that's absolutely fantastic. Um, and yeah, obviously now, um, if you were able to do the SBCs for the Ultimate Tots, you probably want to look at maybe going for a high rated player. Um, alternatively, if you haven't done uh, any of the Team of the Season players yet, uh, you may want to potentially consider getting some of the lower starters, like for example, and that's if you want to do go through and do you know, some of the Ultimate Tot SPCs. Like for example, you could do Rabio, who requires uh, you know, 66 vouchers in total. Alternatively, you know, you could go through and do Rabio Fabinho from the community. Um, so you can get those starter requirements. Like, it's, it's just such a mess, guys, to be honest. Like, the fact that you can no longer use EFL players as starters. Like, you're saving so many vouchers by, you know, doing those SPCs with the EFL players in them. Um, but unfortunately, it's just been taken away. Um, and like the weekend tournament, guys, you know, when there was that free starter available from the weekend tournament, People who were online at the time were able to get access to it and others weren't, which is just, I, I don't like it guys, I really don't like it. I don't think it's very fair practice, in my opinion whatsoever. Um, but as you can see here, we're just going through slowly and are picking up these vouchers. Our pack like hasn't been the greatest as of yet. Let's see what we can get in this pack. Um, also guys, I was considering getting the likes of uh, Griezmann, Cruz and potentially uh, Sergio Ramos. But because of the fact that Ronaldo, he did actually gift uh, 2,000 skill boosts plus 1,380. So around 3,180 3, skill boosts in total for the Ronaldo. I was like, yeah, I'm going to go for the Ronaldo because the skill boosts are so worth it, guys, in my opinion. I was also considering doing the Messi, but the Messi only gives 2.5 million coins per node. And if you think about it, the Cristiano Ronaldo who gives the... 1,000 skill boost per node guys, that's worth like 5 million coins from the store if you go through and purchase other uh, packs for the, the 20k packs that is anyway. So that's why I'm definitely doing the Cristiano Ronaldo. Um, did you guys manage to go through and complete the team of the season cards that you wanted to? Um, let me know in the comment section down below. But guys, yeah, it's it's all a bit of a mess to be honest. Like this is like such a big advantage and it is, it is really sort of messed up sort of what has happened uh, with team of the season because Despite all the, the problems with like the game and, and such, it was actually an okay event, but this overarching thing that has affected the SBCs in, in terms of not allowing the EFL players and the EFL players not counting as, uh, you know, the starters, it's sort of like put a, a, a dampener on the, on the promo, guys. Once again, I'm not surprised to be honest with you, uh, to say the least, but it just they, they just need to do better checking and better quality control uh, at the headquarters because obviously guys there's something wrong like every single event guys there's something that that goes wrong um but yeah also another thing that you can consider if you did do the SBCs with the EFL players is that you can obviously use um those vouchers to convert into points guys so I could go through and convert those 1500 points that I got from the SBCs into like Liga points but I'm not going to I think I'm just going to go for a whole bunch of uh, ultimate tots players and we will go through that probably tomorrow if we do get time um, also guys obviously it looks as though this is one of the last weeks for tournament I'm not sure if it is going to be returning but make sure that if you haven't or if you've got a whole bunch of vouchers um, maybe consider using them. I don't know if it's going to come back though, but 
we never know guys with, with this game we actually have no idea what's going on like it's it's so hard to compare for anything because there's just no transparency and there's so many bugs which really do render uh, the quality of the game so I'm gonna be grinding out the tournament I got a few vouchers also um, if you guys remember I was considering picking up the world-class pass sorry the the FIFA champion pass due to the verse attack tokens um, but one of the main draw cards behind that was the fact that we got 25 uh, vouchers guys and I'm not sure if we are going to be doing that nowadays um, I have to just wait and see uh, but we we will definitely decide in the next few days Opening up a few more packs guys so we do need I think I think we need 321 more points because we've gone through and collected up until the 8th uh, point node for the, the elite player on each of the leagues so let's see what we can get as we get Mario and Snodgrass so as you guys can also see the card art of these EFL players um, the ones with the lightning at the bottom, like the Sessegnon, the Neves, the Kearney, they were all counting as starters, guys. They were all counting as starters. Um, and, yeah, obviously, like I did say, it's just such a huge way to save vouchers. But, of course, it's all been taken away. Let me know what you guys are doing. Are you guys going to just go through and pick up one big team of the season starter? Or are you going to go through and pick up a whole bunch of lower tier ones so you can complete ultimate tots? But guys, jumping into the tree and then going through. So guys, we're just going through and working through the tree of the La Liga tots. Um, so obviously, like I did say, the Ronaldo in total, guys, he does cost 987 vouchers from scratch. Um, now, obviously, what that meant is that I had to forego a whole bunch of other players. Um, but I just wanted to get him uh, due to the fact that he did offer a whole bunch of skill boosts. And because he is a 95 overall card, and I'm hoping that I can sell him for a little bit. But who knows, like seriously, because there's so many people, um, you know, who got the compensation, who are saving vouchers. Like the market when all these cards become auctionable, guys, is going to be, it's going to be something else, I think. You know, on the 6th of June, who knows what these prices are going to be. Are they going to be low? Are they going to be high? Um, also, another thing that I was considering was potentially uh, Team of the Season, De Bruyne and De Gea. Let's just go through and open this pack up. What do we get? And we do pull a master, guys. Okay, I'll take that. We actually get Diego Godin. That's a sick pull. Um, wasn't expecting that whatsoever. So that is from the six-point node. Um, wow, okay. That, that's a, a, a special master, I suppose, that I'll take. Um, that's, that's one good thing. Uh, but yeah, guys, like I was saying, I was considering doing De Bruyne and De Gea, the 93 overalls, because I could have done them. Um, I could have also, like I did say, uh, potentially have done Griezmann, Cruz, and uh, Sergio Ramos. But a lot of these cards have got Ultimate Tots cards. Um, so I was like, I'm, I'm just not going to do it. I'm going to just go through and, uh, you know, do the Ronaldo because I do want those skill boosts. So skill boosts are very, very tempting. And the other 295 players, the Mohamed Salah and the Messi, they only give coins. And for me, I don't really need coins. I feel that skill boosts have got better value because... If you went through to the store and purchased the same amount of skill boost, you definitely wouldn't get uh, the same back. Obviously, coins have more sort of uh, variety to them and you can use them in various different instances. But for me, the skill boosts are definitely something uh, that I am considering doing. Uh, also, guys, another thing that I wanted to quickly talk about was Bundesliga as well. You could have potentially looked at doing uh, Rodriguez, Muller. Uh, Naldo, Hummels, like some of those, a combination of some of those players. Um, but yeah, like I said, I'm just happy to go through and take the skill boosts plus a 95 overall base card, which I'm hoping will go for a, a little bit. What do you guys think the likes of uh, Messi, uh, you know, Griezmann, Sergio Ramos, Lewandowski, Rodriguez, Salah, De Gea, um, those types of cards, what do you think they'll go for, guys? Let me know in the comment section down below. Are you guys planning on getting a whole bunch of coins and then buying a few players? I could potentially look at doing that as well. But I'm just going to go through and jump into the final few nodes and then and end moving the on to the final node for the Cristiano Ronaldo, guys. So we just need to go through and convert one more voucher. Um, and we did go through and claim up those 2,000 skill boosts, which is absolutely fantastic. One thing, though, is that, you know, you can quite easily get skill boosts from the tournament. That's one thing that I'm going to miss about uh, the tournament, guys, is, you know, the 750 skill boost, the 1,500 skill boost that you can get uh, relatively easily. That is definitely one big draw card of the uh, weekend tournament for me, as well as the 250 gold player cards. Um, but yeah, guys, not really all that much to say. Like, I'm still pretty disappointed, despite the fact that, you know, I did do the SPCs. Um, I know how it feels, guys, because I was there during the Team of the Year stuff, and it was it just... It was just it was crazy man it was absolutely crazy 
But nevertheless, we did get this Ronaldo as well as this Team of the Season logo, which looks pretty nice. And there he is, guys, a 95 overall Cristiano Ronaldo. But other than that, guys, it's pretty much just going to be the end of the video for today. Thank you all for everything and peace.